happy that we, there's no injuries. Uh, we had uh, Kagoma that uh, trained the first week and then had a slight uh, niggle. So Kagoma is the only one that has missed now the last two weeks. But we'll have him back uh, for next week. So thankfully there's been uh, no complications now with everybody coming through with the match minutes in, in how we periodize the, the load. Um, yes, we got the result today. Uh, result not so important always uh, in terms of these friendly matches, but process, how we are improving our defensive uh, actions, how we are improving our attacking fluidity and uh, can the players build this non-verbal communication, uh, knowing which spaces to take, how to attack, which runs to make, where the ball is going next, uh, and then so it becomes fluid and we have this synergy, we have this energy amongst the players and we're slowly building that step by step. I think now with the third week we've, we've gotten to a point where uh, we covered a lot of uh, tactical work and sometimes it's about repeating, refreshing uh, the work that we've done but also introducing step by step uh, uh, new things in terms of how we want to do it sometimes without the ball um, certain areas, especially our defence line, our midfield lines, how we can have this connection between the two and then again playing as a unit with the ball in which uh, area we are and are we already thinking about the next phase if we if we in good positions with the ball are we then able to uh, win the ball back when we lose it uh, and so forth so a lot has been done a lot has been uh, achieved in this camp uh, it's, it's again like I said a, a small step um, we have the next week that is the Simba day uh, to introduce everyone to the fans and uh, like I said, 13 new players uh, getting to know each other, blending in with the with the older players, and a lot of a lot of our a lot of our profiles that we have signed is is of the younger uh, players. So, learning, improving, coaching, uh, uh, integrating with the with the players that are here, uh, step by step. We we're forming a team. And that's the most important thing. Uh, it's the players that is going to form the team. If we can be strong as a team, we will be able to be successful this season. Yeah, I think the 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 match gave us a lot of information today the communication without the ball uh, managing the game 2-0 uh, up the game is easy and then you start the second half with a dubious penalty okay they, they took the penalty they uh, I don't think it was but uh, immediately going 1-0 uh, um, them 2-1 uh, uh, beginning of the second half and now we're able to manage that and that's where you get to understand the players who are the, the calmer heads what do we do do we uh, become compact do we start to high press uh, and these are the information that we get as, as coaches, but also the teammates. Yeah, can they rely on the, the player suddenly, a new player playing with me in the double six, or a new winger, or a new striker with new movement? So integrating these 13 players, there has been huge improvement in the, in the new players, and of course in the old players as well. So <laughs> forming this team, forming this unit uh, is the most important objective of this preseason. Is it time for the Lion to roll? Yeah, step by step. You know, we... we, we First of all is to create this, this unit, this team, this synergy, this, this team spirit. Uh, once we can create this, once we can form this, this unit with the ball, without the ball, uh, then we will be able to achieve something this season. Like I said, we are uh, creating this mindset that for every match we play, we want three points. For every cup we uh, participate in, we want to win it, to create that winning mentality. So step by step, let us be calm. Uh, let us not be overexcited for, for all the wins uh, that we've got. Uh, let's keep building the process and uh, let our performances talk on the pitch. Thank you very much. You're the best coach. Thank you so much. You are watching Digital News Tanzania.